Sultan here, back with more Fairy Legends of Avalon. This is where we left off last time, right before I was going into the beehive. So let's uh, let's step inside. Let's see what we got. Ooh, it's very beehivey, that's for sure. Beehivey? New stage, find the queen hornet. Is this a hornet's nest? This is not a beehive. Are we ready for this? Ooh. Are we ready for this? I think we are. Let's do it. Oh yeah, we got this. Uh, let's see, Young Hornet, Sniper Hornet. Oh, this isn't even the... Alright, well let's take him out. Let's take out the Sniper. I'm gonna take out that Sniper first. Get that critical, 66 damage. Almost killed the sniper, man. Azel, you're a beast. I think we just do regular attacks against this hornet. I don't think they're physically resistant, if I remember right. Oh, he is physically resistant. Oh no. All right, well, throw some rocks at this guy. Yes, got that weakened. Okay, so, um. Magic. Ooh, at 88 crit. Oh my. We leveled up! Level 10. Excellent. Alright, so we can do a pattern now. Oh, which I can't do. It's actually a lot of these. Uh, arm, uh, torso. Tail, horns. All right, we were gonna do um, this, the vitality field. Upgrade that so that we can heal more people. Yes, confirm. So we got in this chest. Reanimation elixir, take it. Uh, where else do we? Oh, well, oh, oh, apparently I got into a fight. Poisonous hornet and two snipers. Okay. Let's take out these snipers first. Actually, you know what? I might want to take out the poison. I don't even know. Alright, got the crit. It's weak to magic, so we'll uh, pop this guy twice. I think that should be enough, and then we'll go after the other one. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's gonna be enough. Yeah. You're gone. Yeah. Ooh, he dodged it. Come on, Bert. Weaken him. That's good. Good. Hey, you poisonous jerk. I think uh, I think two of these should do it. We'll find out. Oh yeah, one of them did it. Ooh, look at these crits. That's how you do things. Stunned him too. All right. All right, Bert, you got this. There we go. Good job, Bert. So we got 733 to next level up. Uh, more hornets. Oh, that looks like the queen right there. There's a big red hornet. It's not going to be this fight, but I think it'll be in the next fight. Uh, let's see, we got Big Hornet, Sniper Hornet, and Gunner Hornet. Uh, let's take out the Gunner, I think, first.
There's a crit, okay. We got the tornado. You know, it's funny, I think this game is literally built so that you have to be a support. Because you got a physical attacker in Burt, you got a magical attacker in Azel. Ooh, he's poisoned. And then, you know, you can be the healer, so. Right? Go ahead and do this. 30 damage from rocks. I did a lot more magic than I, or damage than I thought it was going to. Um, sniper or big? We're gonna go sniper. 33 damage. Get a crit. 66. Yes. One more crit. Yes. Good job. All right. Uh, let's do defensive magic, and we can do vitality field. Um, and we'll do it on Bert. And then we'll do our tornado on this guy. So he's got regeneration for five turns, so the poison shouldn't do that much to him. Yeah, so we're good. Alright. Counteract the poison with some uh, ant spells. Alright, so he's weakened. Giselle goes next, so hopefully she'll be able to... Well, actually, I think his weakened was actually ticked off on his last rock. That's alright. We got this. Offensive magic, tornado... Stunned again. Uh, that's two action points gone. Yeah. Oh, he poisoned me. So he heals for 36 and gets hurt by 19. So the heal is actually outweighing the poison. Get another weekend. Get a weekend. Yes! Alright, Azel. Get a crit on this. The first lightning. Come on. Yes! <laughs> Excellent. 233 to next level. Okay, that is. That is a big queen. Combat the Queen Hornet. She is. a big girl. Alright, and she's got three little buddies. Well, of course we take out the buddies first. Ooh, the music changed. Um, Young Hornet, Poisonous Hornet, and Sniper Hornet. I think we want to take out the Poisonous one first. So we don't have to deal with that for a while. So let's take out the Poisonous Hornet, which is this guy. Hopefully the Queen Hornet doesn't do too much damage. Ooh, there's a nice little crit. Alright. Then we'll hit this guy for three, and that should be the end of the Poison Hornet. I think I wasted an attack. Yep, oh well. Alright, Queen Hornet, how much damage do you do? Not a lot, please not a lot. Oh, she's a support? Really? Okay. Uh, sniper. That was a very support move. So their next damage is going to be pretty, pretty dangerous. Let's see how much. Ooh. It was a lot, but it wasn't, you know, a crazy amount. And this should kill the sniper. Excellent. Uh, all 
right, let's uh, let's get rid of the baby. Another support move next to attack enhanced. This is easy. I thought this was going to be difficult at some point. Against the ginormous queen. Alright, well, baby's dead. Alright, well, let's do some lightning just discharge here. Crit, nice. She's got a lot of health though. Do some tornado. She's got a ton of health. That uh, doesn't do that much damage. Poison, though. All right. That's a nice little hit there. Weakened again. Alright, Azel. Get this crit. First one. Yes. Another crit. Alright. Uh, defensive magic, vitality field. We're going to do it on Burt. And then we're going to go ahead and do Tornado. Put that regeneration on him. Man, she really likes Bert. Poison again. That's alright. Let's do rocks. It's a magic lightning. Oh yeah, we got this. No problem. It's another crit. It's a tornado this guy, and this should be the end of the queen. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. I think Bird will do it. All right, Bert, you got this. Weakened. There we go. 42 damage for the win. 692. Whoa, we gained a level. School points plus one. Maximum action points plus five. Bert loves you a bit less. The hornets will cease to devour it and demean the valuable leaves of this valiant tree. I feel very bad for the death of their queen. We would have let her rather fly away free. Oh. Why? The tree is cured. Now we can return to Avalon to help another world. That's good news, no? No, I fear alas, alack. No solution came from our mode of attack. Far from salvational, we were a bit confrontational. The tree is still dying. Do you not feel? The hornets were never the root of the ordeal. <laughs> I'm a jerk. Curses. They're truly despicable beasts. So it's not so bad. They could have hurt someone. Let us speak to the inhabitants to find the real cause of the illness. I dreamt of capturing the hornets in flight, for I like to observe while you like to fight. I made several sketches before they passed away. The work is now complete. Let us on our way. Stay in the nest. You can keep admiring them if you wish while we search the nests more thoroughly. Then we'll go back to the question and question the villagers. Oh, Bert. Oh, Bert. What do I need? Level 12 to get this back up. Um. I think we'll do this one. Continue with our healing support character 
Bracelets of air sets. Uh, anything else in here? Any hidden chests that I should know about? No? Alright. Well, that was fun. Uh, 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 where's the exit? There's the exit. Hornets? More of them. Weapons of air set. Man, I'm finding all kinds of stuff. Let's take out these hornets. Offensive magic. Uh, lightning discharge. Nova? Hold on. What? When she learned that. Alright. Gunner Hornet. Me, we will do tornado. I wonder if Bert learned a new skill. He did. Stone Storm. Sweet. Those AoE attacks, because that'd be nice. They sound like them. Stone Storm and Nova. You would assume those would be. You know what, I just kinda wanna see what it does. Whoa. <laughs> That's pretty neat. Alright. My turn, defensive magic, vitality field on myself, and then we'll do offensive magic tornado on you. Don't poison him. Don't do it. Darn it. It's alright. Let's look at some Stone Storm. See what that's like. <laughs> it's weakened. Uh, offensive magic, lightning discharge. It looks like there's one turn timer on those attacks. I guess makes sense. And then we'll do a couple tornadoes, a Trace Tornado attack, and that should be the end of them. Oh, nope, never mind. Don't poison me again. Alright, 112 experience to the next up. Man, we are leveling up all kinds of crazy over here. Uh, okay, so. That is not the real root of the problem. The Hornets are not the real root of the problem, so we have to find out what the actual problem is. We have to talk to Puck for her. Ooh, there's a chest right here that I didn't notice. Boots of Fire Set. And we gotta free the raccoon. Okay, here's. Puck. Actually, we gotta talk to. Uh, is that her? Yes. To see what Puck likes. Cake! There it is. Wants to offer Puck a cake. What do you suggest? Well, today's chef's suggestion is fern fritters. He loves them. Go fetch me a spring of fern. Sprig of fern, and I'll knock them up in a jiffy. I'm off. Alright, so we gotta find some. fritters? Find some fritters. Chuck to Chugfly. We haven't chucked to Chugfly in a while. Talk to Chugfly. What can I do for you? I'd like to ask you several questions. Fire away. I'm all ears. 
Uh, tree illness. I managed to defeat the hornets, but unfortunately, Yagrasil is still ailing. You wouldn't have any idea why. Alas, I do not. You should ask the other inhabitants. Perhaps they know. Uh, let's see... Rocky Raccoon. We're looking for a way of freeing Rocky Raccoon from the wolf trap. He's gonna tell me to go talk to the beekeeper. Which I gotta find where the beekeeper is. And... Oh, shoot. what I do that again? Um, I wanna ask him about the egg. Egg! I have a dragon egg I wish to hatch. You wouldn't have any idea how, would you? If your egg was weren't so large, I would have suggested asking the ants to put it in their in incubator. Otherwise, I'm stumped. Thank you. Farewell. They have an incubator? Can't go in the ant mound. Okay, so we gotta find some fritters. There's the beekeeper! Don't move around like that. You'll disturb the bees. You must be gentle with my bees. Questions. I have some questions I wish to ask you. I wish to ask you. I'm listening. Rocky Raccoon. Grim's friend the raccoon has been caught in a gigantic wolf trap. You don't know how to free it, do you? The trap will be too big for brute force to work. Did you try and rust the metal at its joints to make it fall apart? One ancestral recipe for rust states that you should use the tears of one who never cries. These tears are so acidic, they corrode the metal in twinkling. Tears of one who never cries. Thank you, I shall try that, however hard it may be. You wouldn't know where I might find such a rarity, would you? Alas, no. But if you ask the other inhabitants, perhaps they'll know. Thanks, thank you, farewell. Alright, um... So we can't free the raccoon. We need some tears of someone who never cries. Uh, that's Puck. How do you sell it? What can I do for you? Uh, can you answer several questions for me? Sure, I'm all ears. Tears. I require tears from someone who never cries. Where might I find them? Someone who never cries? Old Red, he's your fellow. But where is he skulking is anyone's guess. Folks are not big fans of his around here. Try asking his sister, White. White is Red's sister. That makes sense. <laughs> Thank you for this information. I must go now. Their parents must not have been very creative. I'm just saying. Like, White and Red? I don't know. Hello again. What can I do for you? Questions or self questions I wish to ask you. I'm listening. Tears. I require the tears of someone who never cries. Do you know where I might find such a person? Hmm. My sister. No mistake. She hates everyone. I do believe she has never ever shed a single tear. Her house is up there where the branches part. She might not answer you because she does enjoy her solitude. You're going to need a silver tongue. Uh, what? Thank you. I shall go see her. All right, she was up here somewhere, correct? If I remember right, is this her? Huh? Huh? Nope, that's not it. Over here? Nope, that's not it. She wasn't that high. I don't think. It's the beekeeper. I just want a big circle. Uh, there it is. Clear off, you filthy, busy thing. Filthy. Story. But I have a story to tell you. I'm sure you will like it. A story? It better be good. I also send you flying into the middle of next week. Okay. I assure you, you won't be disappointed. Right. What's the story you want to tell me? Start. Calm down, make yourself comfortable, and I shall begin. She is ugly. Oh my. Hurry up! I can't stand around all day waiting. Uh, faraway land? Once upon a time in a faraway land. Yeah, so what? 
poor dying soldier. There was once a poor ailing soldier who was to die without seeing his children again. Man, this is depressing. What? Serves him right. What? What a jerk. Start again. I don't think I began on the right foot. Let's start again. No, you were brilliant. If you've got any more like that. Uh, starving orphan? Once upon there was a poor starving orphan who lived with his cruel stepmother. Brilliant. Love it. What happens to him? Does he choke on a chunk of stall stale bread? I hope so. What the? <laughs> this woman! It's a guess that's what you could call her a woman. I don't think I'm going to start again. Wondrous land. Once upon a time there was one less land. What? Poppy cop. That's a terrible beginning. Wondrous land. Uh, without war. Where peace reigned, where people loved each other as brothers, and there were no one had heard of war. Stuff and nonsense. What a terrible story. Whatever goes on inside your head. Once upon a time in a wondrous land lived a beautiful princess who fell madly in love with a handsome prince. They married and had many, many children. Hogrot! Where, th where are the evil stepsisters, the witches, the dragons, and black magicians? What a massacre! You ruined everything, everything that is beautiful in stories. You knave, you scoundrel, you abomination, boo hoo hoo. Tears. What? Thank you for those tears, so sincere. They'll be useful to me. That was the lamest conversation ever. Alrighty, guys, well, I'll end this episode here. We got the tears, we beat the hornets, and I'll see you guys next time.